Shoppers headed to the stores this weekend may see some new technology that's supposed to protect you from fraud. But as News 3's Keely Arthur reports, many chip card readers are not usable yet, Keely. Michelle, many stores in our area have the readers installed, but due to slow software updates, they're not running. An annoyance for shoppers, but a big problem for retailers my second Thanksgiving shopping. While most of us are still sleeping off Thursday's festivities, Lynn Thomas is preparing for Thanksgiving dinner part two. We already had one yesterday, but we're having one tomorrow again. Using her trusted credit card to cover the fixings. All my purchases. And while Thomas loves the added security of her new chip card, she's not put it to use once this holiday season. So many places don't have the reader yet, and I know I think they don't have it yet. Miller and Sons chip card readers are installed yet not operational, with software vendors taking their time transitioning away from the swipe. No, it's a little frustrating waiting for uh, the, the software, the capability for us to uh, process chip cards, but. It's probably more frustrating for the customer because they want to use their chip card because they'll feel more secure using it. But retailers will feel more secure once everything is up and running too. Now that the bank provides the consumer this credit card with a chip, if the store is not properly equipped to use that technology and there's a security breach, now the store is actually liable for it, not the credit card company. For the shoppers though, there's not much to worry about. This year's shopping season, to you and me, is going to be a lot like last year's and the years before. Like all the holidays before, though, identity theft is a possibility. So remember to check everything, like bake statements, twice. Because then you'll see that when you bought something at my store, I triple charged you or I double charged you. Or suddenly there's a, you know, a charge in Tacoma, Washington. Places like Target and Trader Joe's already have their car readers up and running. Miller and Son says they will have theirs ready to go early next year. Hey, a lot of people ready for that. Thank you, Keely.